Hey guys, I'm Wedge Fairy, and this is Deadly Premonition. Uh, last time we shot a bunch of really terrifying backwards bending zombies, and now we're going to continue onwards. So we came that way. I want to keep the gun, please. Oh, hey, there's a something. Please give me money. I'm happy to take your money. Thank you all. That sign says nothing. Greenvale? Maybe it said Greenvale at some point. Oh, I don't like this. Okay, well. Observe. Power's back. Bless civilization and automated doors. Come on, let's get moving, Zach. Open. Oh, I don't like that it closed behind us. Start profiling! We haven't met any of those people or done any of these things yet. I've been through a lot of crazy situations, but that one, that one takes the cake. It's the first time I've been attacked so directly. It was gross and awful too. Zach, can you give me a logical explanation about what that was? Never mind, don't answer. Life is fun because of the mysteries, right Zach? I don't think these mysteries make life fun. First, let's get whatever this is. Let's take the lollipop. Oh, it's a Chupa Chups or Chupa Chups or Chupa Chups or whatever. My favorite brand. Oh, I can save at the telephones. Yeah, I really do. Observe. I should report to headquarters. Give them up an update. Apparently, that's what we just did. I would like guns. Ooh, no. Oh, and there go the lights again. Oh, something tells me we're gonna get attacked by zombies again. Gun. Oh, no. I was prepared for that one. Is it dead or not dead? Dead, not dead. dead okay. I'm sorry if it's jumpy. That's what happens when I move the mouse down if it's jumpy. No, gun. Why would you put your gun away? You're being attacked by things. I hear footsteps. God, I hear footsteps. Uh, which way do I go? Oh my god. Space. Let's take that steel pipe. I already have one, but we're taking another one anyway. another generator, thank goodness. Let's turn that shit on. Yes, please. Okay. Gun. Honestly, I don't think having the gun out already makes it any easier. That's the way we came from. I had to reload. Amazing. Oh, all of a sudden couldn't see. This is creepy and terrifying, and I'm not 100% certain I like this. Oh. 
I should have known. Twin Peaks scares the crap out of me. Why wouldn't a game inspired by Twin Peaks scare the crap out of me? Emily, what were you thinking? Oh god, there's a guy right there. All for my collectibles. Gross, gross, gross. Oh, I need to switch to a steel pipe. Oh my god, I should be breaking crates! Oh, frig. I'm not going all the way back there to break more crates. That's not happening. But now I will know to break the crates I come across. I hear walking. I hear walking. Oh god, she's right there. You dropped something. What can I have of yours? Oh, I'd like that first aid kit. I'm doing okay right now. We only got attacked the once, because now I'm super afraid. Oh yeah, I'm gonna have to change the mouse sensitivity. I should have done that between episodes. Oh goodness, there was an exploding thing there! to the gun. Oh, well, I don't think this one's gonna work, but we can give it a shot. Or is there a mini game? The generator looks really bad, Zack. I think the killer really had a grudge against it. How do I know it's an axe? Oh, because there's an axe right next to me. Profiling. I don't really know what this is doing. I don't understand the mechanic yet. It just told me to press a button, so I did. <gasps> Let's try and find a way to fix this mess. We got fuse box. Hey, is this ammo? Can I have ammo? Toolbox. Uh... Ah. Okay, good. I want all of those items on my person. It's fine. Nothing I can do with this fuse box? No. Not here, at least. I don't know if you can hear it, because it's kind of quiet, but there's like a faint, wet, sloshy footstep sound behind me constantly. I do not like the noises that happen in this game. I'm glad I have more than one steel pipe because my condition goes down. Back to the gun, please. It's locked with a padlock. It said I should be able to break it open if I hit it hard enough. Alright, we've done so. Open the ruddy door. Don't just walk in there! I want to be protected! What if there are zombies? Great. 
awesome. Oh. All of a sudden, there was a zombie. All right. Turn on. Fuse box. Select. Punk. Yeah. So it's kind of point and click adventure where you need to have the items in your inventory. But then it will complete the puzzle for you pretty much. Okay. We'll observe. What was I observing there? Doesn't look like anyone lives here. Okay. I hear voices from outside. We're on the gun. Okay, there's a lot of them now. It's not close enough. There we go. Used a lot of bullets for that. Scary as shit. I'll probably put these two videos, the first one and this one, up on the same day. So, I just so you know, I am still terrified. I stopped and refilled my coffee, because again, it's like 10 o'clock in the morning, or 11 o'clock in the morning now. I'm just Oh shit, right here in front of us. The trick seems to be kill them before they do the bendy over backwards thing because they're faster that way. This is creepy and I don't like it, but it's really cool. I just don't like it because it's scary. Oh god, shoot! Great. You're great. Oh, no going back now, huh? that a lot from me. Because I don't. Have I told you recently how much I don't like scary things? I don't like scary things. I really don't like scary things. Okay, that's not the way we're supposed to go. crates, but it's too scary! Okay, so they're coming from there. So if I stay here, they're just gonna keep coming out. Come on. I like the way they walk. It kind of looks like they're dancing. Oh, back to the gun, please. There is a run button, but I feel like that could easily get out of hand. Oh god, there's a guy right there! Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Oh god! Oh my god, did he just kill me? Oh 
my god, I died. Well, we're gonna continue. Oh my god, from here? This is the last door, right? Okay, good. Okay, we know a little more of what to expect here, so it's a little less terrifying. It's two buttons held down simultaneously to shoot. One to have the gun drawn and one to shoot. So, um, oh god. Oh, that was good. Oh, I want those. Um, let's shoot this person first. No, come on, 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 come on. Oh god. Shoot, 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 shoot. Please take these bullets. Thank you. I'm stuck. You get stuck on the dead bodies, by the way. If anybody decides they hate themselves and want to do this. There's a guy behind me. I know that noise. Okay. Keep moving. Okay, it's going to be E to evade, then A, D, A, D, A, D to evade again. Uh, yeah, I rolled! No? Oh, he's running. Oh, well, that was easy. I don't want to go after him. Let's keep moving. I really don't want to go after him. He's scary and I don't like that. No. Oh. oh, how do I reload again? Wait a sec. R to reload. Apparently I can only reload when I'm empty. Maybe I can reload. Come stop. Oh, there we go. Observe first. There's red ivy climbing this. If we don't go soon, the red ivy will lock it up. Oh, yep. That's what that meant. Uh-oh. Uh we got some red ivy. Third clue. Can we please leave this terrible area now? Profiling start. It happens automatically, apparently, when we get all three clues. Or at least it did just there. <sighs> oh, recovers hunger. Oh my god, we get hungry? Oh my god. I wish I'd known that. Maybe I should be eating. There's definitely something in this town. Really? Do you feel it, Zach? My coffee warned me about it. My coffee warned me about Yesterday it? Yesterday morning, the milk I poured in my coffee made a sign. Did it? It said... Tomorrow you'll arrive in a place that will change your fate. Um, uh, right. Okay, let's save. Oh, please save. Why would I say no to that? So we want to go this way. Excellent. Oh, Emmett's navigation. Shift is run. Oh. Looks like I have a stamina bar that I shouldn't be filling up. The bad kind of stamina, not the good kind of stamina. Um, how do I get into my toolbox? I don't know. Forest creatures making noise. No forest creatures. Okay. Let's jog there. 
It's not scary nighttime raining anymore. I'm actually kind of glad we died there. It was some like catharsis. Like I was so tense and scared that when we died, I just, ah, <sighs> all right then. Sugar donuts. Do you love sugar donuts? Who's this? It's a lady. Oh, you're very late. Hi, lady. Her name is. <laughs> what is it with me playing games with people named Emily? Greenvale Deputy Sheriff. I didn't think you'd keep me waiting in the rain for so long. FBI Special Agent Francis York Morgan. I think. Please just. He know. She knows who you are. Honey. That's what everyone calls me. Agent York. Good. That's good. <laughs> are you the sheriff? Uh, no, I'm Deputy Sheriff Emily Wyatt. George, he's the sheriff. He went looking for you, actually. He should be back soon. Hmm. I see. If you don't mind me asking, did you walk all the way here? My car broke down, that's all. We're not going to be honest and tell her I hit the crazy guy with an axe in a raincoat drove me off the road? What is this She's pretty music? Eyes. Definitely worth the trip to the <laughs> she is pretty. Place. She's got a better character but model than you have. Don't mention anything about what happened back there. She's, you're a psycho. Uh, you could. Want that? You that. Could. Welcome to Greenville. I'm the sheriff, George Woodman. Come Hello, that his name is a Woodman. George Woodman, Greenville Sheriff. Isn't Greenville what the name of the town and community FBI as well? Agent or is it Francis Greendale? York Morgan. Please, just call me York. That's what everyone calls me. He looks very suspicious. Could you tell me why the FBI is so interested in a small town homicide? Ah. Uh, Let's just say it's a personal interest in killers of young women. I'm always looking for new sample cases to help me with my profile. Both our superiors are clear with each other. Yeah, like, you can I'm here problem. now. You don't have a problem with this, do you? No. No problem. Just want to set things straight. Our small town has its share of problems. I'm the one <sighs> fixing them one by one and maintaining peace and order. Mm -hmm. You can have your profiling sample, but I need you to understand that. No, nope, no problem. Of course. Of course. <laughs> By the way, George, I had a little accident with my car. Could you send someone to take care of it? Oh, and my clothes and luggage are still inside. All right. Don't worry. Yeah. I'll get my assistant, Thomas, to take care of it. He has an assistant named Thomas. Do you need anything else? All right. <laughs> This is a very tense meeting. I'm feeling he doesn't like that the FBI is all up here. I'll rest up first at the hotel. Then I'll join you on your investigation. Don't know how to say that. I uh, really don't need your help. Unlike some of your corrupt city police officers, oh, geez. I hope you'll come to appreciate that, Agent Morgan. Why would you do that? handle the investigation. You just think of this as a vacation. Take it easy. Enjoy the nature here. You don't have to be a tree worshiper to appreciate the wildlife. <laughs> you, you're just making him want to be involved in the investigation even more. And we've just met the king. Yep. Pretty much. I love what? MOV? You say I love MOV? Yay! Total cleared time 35 minutes. Total number of days 1. Enemy defeated 35. We killed 35 dudes! Number of continues 1. Well, that wasn't great. $200. Basic wage, unpaid salary. Oh, we got a thousand dollars to go on. Um, do we want to save? Oh, I think we do. Oh, I really think we do. Previously during the investigation, Zach, you. These puppies are making me go to another town in the boondocks again. 
I didn't think you'd keep me waiting in the rain for so long. Welcome to Greenwood. I'm Sheriff George Woodman. Call me George. There's definitely something in this town. Do you feel it, Zach? My coffee warned me about it. <gasps> it's broken. I've been using that one for a long time. Why didn't you get it repaired? This TV is important to you, right? It got some memories attached to it, sure. I used to watch movies on this thing with your grandma all the time. Grandma liked movies? Of course she did. Everyone loves movies, right? I love movies, too. I've never been to a movie theater, though. Okay, I'm going to leave this one here for now. You'll probably see some of that recap footage at the beginning of the next episode. Because I didn't realize we were going to jump right into this. Thank you very much for watching. Again, my name is Wench Fairy. This is Deadly Premonition, the director's cut, if I haven't mentioned that before. And I hope to see you next time.